from the mountains high above Hollywood, California, it's the Surfing Monkey Show with your host, Thomas Rounds. And David Urey, what's happening? It's episode number five. No way, episode yeah. five already. I know. Wow, I really would have thought we would be canceled by now. Yeah, we were expecting the internet to just come in and <laughs> shut this whole thing down. Yeah, because I know the internet is very picky about what they put on. Right, if you've right? watched anything online, you know the internet is a real stickler for content quality. <laughs> they are. <laughs> But, you know, the show is up and running now. So. Yeah, you know what we need to do is get we'll make one of those promos. Yeah, you know, yeah. Like, through reality shows where they kind of stand there and they look all... Oh, yeah, all kinda, tough. Because we need to show the audience and potential yeah. viewers how tough and no-nonsense <laughs> yes, we how are. how tough we are. We have to shoot guns sometimes. We have to shoot guns a lot of times. And I especially hate blanks because... When you shoot them, like, sand blows into your eye. Blanks are scary. I mean, just the energy from a blank will, will kill someone up to 10 feet away. Yeah, that's I why mean, I make sure that the person's 11 feet before yes. I aim the gun at the head and pull the trigger. It's good. And I always make the mistake, too, of going <laughs> like that. Right. The director has to say, no, no, we're going to put the sound effects in. It's just such a habit from, like... <laughs> You're like, I'm sorry, but it doesn't feel real to me unless I'm going... <laughs> You know, I worked on this movie uh, as an extra years ago, and they had a lot of cop extras. Yeah. And uh, everyone's going up and getting their prop guns from the right. prop master, you know, and they're writing everything down, taking it, and this guy comes up and uh, he goes, oh, I already got my own gun. <laughs> and, and everything stops on this. Real yeah, a real gun. And, and they go, that's not loaded, right? He goes, oh, no, it's loaded. <laughs> it's like he just was being enthusiastic, you know. Yeah. I gotta show them how I could be a right. cop. How in character I am. <laughs> yeah, don't bring a real gun. Don't bring a real gun or a knife. <laughs> no, Nothing. casting director, the people who, who cast the, the shows and bring you in for the auditions, they always have a story about some actor who came in for a scene where they have like a knife or something and they bring a real knife and right. they're like threatening <laughs> don't. the casting director with it. You don't need to do that. You don't need a knife or a gun in your audition. Just no. You can just go up to them and throttle them with your parents. <laughs> yes, these are you don't lethal. Need a weapon. Don't, don't strangle them. Don't. No, we really. do not condone strangling casting no. directors. Especially casting directors. Yeah, we love casting directors. <laughs> no, they're really the salt of the earth. They are can't think of enough nice things to say about it. They're the them. salt and pepper. Yeah. They're just great people all around. It's really awesome too. Really wonderful people. Didn't I see you on TV the other night? Yeah, I was on Raising Hope, uh, and I played right. Easter Joe uh, in a couple of episodes. That's why you were in a bunny suit. I'm, in a, I'm a guy, a local character in a bunny rabbit suit that goes around the town. You were great, man. Right. I Thank believed you. you. <laughs> Thank I did. You. A couple of months ago, I had the audition for that role. The same day, I had an audition for a kid's show, like on the Disney Channel or something. Also, as a guy in a bunny rabbit I remember suit. that. Two bunny yes. rabbits in the same day. You would a man with bunny rabbits. You <laughs> could was, be like, you could have a portfolio. Yeah, I wanted to book both of them so that I could have like a special bunny rabbit actor's reel where it's just me as a various bunny rabbit Serious roles. rabbit? My funny rabbit. I want to be the go-to guy in Hollywood whenever a bunny rabbit role comes up and they're like, mm, David Yuri. Because there's, there's a lot of nuance in, in rabbits. And then I also play hares. That's it, folks. You've well, just seen another episode of The Surfing Monkey Show. Thanks for coming, David. Thank you, Thomas. <laughs> Thanks, everybody. Don't hey. forget to subscribe and follow us on Twitter at Is This David Yuri to find out about uh, upcoming episodes and when we're going to be on TV. Absolutely. See you later. Bye. Bye.